Today, we're delving into the exciting world of AI-powered creativity with a groundbreaking tool that's causing a stir in the design industry. This extraordinary new AI is revolutionizing the way we create print-on-demand products by introducing the capability to generate text, a feat that image generators, Midjourney, and Leonardo AI currently struggle with. We're talking about Ideogram AI, an AI image generator that's elevating the art of design to the next level. While Ideogram AI is still in its early stages, it's already capable of producing stunning images with embedded text. In this video, I'll guide you through harnessing your creative potential using this innovative platform. So let's get started. To kickstart your journey with Ideogram AI, simply head to their website, which I've conveniently linked in the description below. The best part? It's currently free to use. Go ahead and set up an account or log in. Upon logging in, you'll be greeted with a sleek and user-friendly interface, making navigation a breeze. You'll immediately notice a section featuring trending images generated by the AI, providing excellent inspiration for your creations. Now, let's explore the basics of Ideogram AI. When you click on one of the images, you can view the prompt that generated it. A fantastic way to gather ideas on what works and what doesn't. You may also come across something called Parent, which represents the original image remixed to create the current image. If you want to use the same parent, simply click on it and create a new image based on the parent image. To generate something similar, just click on the Remix button. This allows you to modify the prompt while generating a new image based on the one you're remixing. Let's try changing cat to tiger and then click Generate. Ideogram AI will generate four new images based on the parent image, showing similarities but not exact replicas. Now, let's dive into the fun part. Creating your own prompts and unlocking the true power of Ideogram AI. Images with text don't have to be lengthy or complex. The AI can work wonders with simple prompts too. To generate a new image, click on the field that says, Describe what you want to see, or if you've already generated an image, Click the field next to the Generate button. You may need to click Clear to remove the old prompt. For a start, let's enter something simple. Cartoon White Ghost with text Boo. You have three options for the image size. The default is 1 to 1. While some suggest 10 to 16 for a t-shirt, for today, let's stick with 1 to 1, square. Next, you can choose different styles for your design or mix and match for experimentation. You also have the option to click Lucky Style for a random style combination, unveiling unique and unexpected designs. For now, let's choose Typography and Poster, then click Generate. Remember, you can currently generate one prompt at a time, and it might take a little time, so brainstorm your next design while waiting. Ideogram has generated four images based on the prompt. As a side note, you can always find images you've previously generated by clicking on the Me icon in the upper right-hand corner. To view your design, go ahead and click on it. Now, let's explore more advanced designs. Ideogram excels at designs with just text. Enter. T-shirt design with a white background saying, have a groovy day with a 60s retro script font in different colors. And select typography and poster. Here are the four images it generated. The last one shows great potential. As Ideogram is still in its early stages, it may occasionally misspell or omit words. If you like a design but something's missing, hit Remix on the image you prefer and it will generate four new similar options based on the one you liked. Often it will correct any misspellings. If not, keep remixing until you find a design you like. Here are the four new options that were generated. The last one demonstrates how Ideogram can add, subtract, or misspell words. Let's try another one. Many of the designs you see on platforms like Etsy feature a silhouette of an animal with some text. Give this a try. Black vector silhouette of a bear on a white background with the text, Mama Bear. Including the words vector and on a white background helps you remove the background making your images cleaner and easier to work with. While it didn't generate the white background, it provided usable images. I 
I like this one the best. It can easily be cleaned up in an image editor. Next up, kawaii style, originating from Japanese pop culture. It's used to create characters, mascots and designs that evoke warmth, happiness and affection. A perfect fit for print on demand. Enter. Cute kawaii llama in sunglasses with the text, No Drama Llama. Though there are a few minor issues with these designs, they've produced some fun ones. Remember that you can always remix a design if it's not exactly what you want. Next is another popular style found on Etsy, Retro Sunset. Try Vintage Retro Sunset Dog T-shirt design, Vector, on a white background with the text, Dog Dad. Ideagram has come up with some nice designs even though they have several issues. Still, I like this design. Let's remix it to see if we can get the text right. There are still a few issues, but it's a decent design that can be easily cleaned up. Next is another classic that you will find others talking about, but I couldn't resist. I love this vintage, distressed American flag look. Type in Vector Vintage Retro Distressed American Flag Design featuring a bald eagle, captured clear outline with white background with text Born Free. Ideogram has generated some great images, but again they will require some minor fixes before they are ready to use. Now, Ideogram's default image quality may not be ideal for selling your designs, especially for on-demand product printing. But don't worry, I've got you covered. Follow these simple steps to enhance quality and remove backgrounds. Let's go to a site called ClipDrop. I've provided a link in the description. You'll need to sign up for a free account. Click on Tools, then Remove Background, and drag and drop the image onto the Clip Drop page. Click Remove Background, and when it's done, download and save it to your hard drive. Next, let's go to Vectorizer.ai, which I've linked in the description. Transforming your image into a vector or SVG file enables you to scale it up without losing quality. Simply drag and drop the image onto the web. It's an automatic process that takes just a few seconds. As you can see when you zoom in, there are minor differences, but now you can increase the image size without quality loss. Click Download. Make sure your file format is SVG and shape stacking is set to stack shapes on top of each other. Then click Download. Once you have your vectorized design, take it to any vector editing software like Adobe Illustrator or import it into Canva. Here, you have complete control to adjust colors, shapes and sizes to create a unique design. I'll now quickly show you how to import your design into Canva for editing, and then use a website called Printify to turn the design into a t-shirt that you can sell on platforms such as Etsy and Shopify, where many creators like you are earning thousands of dollars each month. Again, all these links are in my description, and using my links can grant you discounts on their services. To get started, open Canva and sign up for a free account. Canva is a versatile design tool that allows you to create a wide range of designs and videos. There's so much Canva can do that we can't cover it all in this video, but it's one of the most popular design tools on the internet. After you log in, click Create a Design, then Custom Size. Enter 4500 by 5100, which is the dimensions for a t-shirt, and click Create new design. Once you have the blank canvas, drag and drop your SVG file onto it. You can resize it to your desired size. And then click Share and Download. Adjust the size slider to 3 for higher quality images suitable for printing. Ensure transparent background is checked and click Download. Next, visit Printify. Printify is a print-on-demand company that creates your custom-designed products and ships them directly to your customers. After creating a free account, click Catalog. Here, you'll see a selection of products you can sell, from t-shirts, hoodies, coffee mugs, stickers, phone cases, and more. This is just a small selection of products you can sell with Printify. Click on the item you want to sell Then, start designing. Upload your design, save the product. 
select mock-ups, fill out the information, and publish it on your preferred online marketplace, such as Etsy or your own Shopify store. I know this was an oversimplified process, but it's not that complex. If you'd like a more in-depth video on how to make a full-time income with print on demand, please let me know in the comments and I'll create one. While Ideogram AI, still in its early stages, but it shows amazing potential. That being said, I still recommend Midjourney over Ideogram for image creation. Once you create the image, you can import the image into Canva and add the text you need. Thank you for joining me on this creative journey with Ideogram AI. We've explored the exciting possibilities of this innovative tool and learned how to enhance your designs for print-on-demand products. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and share it with fellow creators. For more tips, tutorials and in-depth content on print-on-demand and design, be sure to subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell so you never miss an update. Your support keeps this channel going. If you have any questions, suggestions or specific topics you'd like me to cover in future videos, please leave a comment down below. I'm here to help you succeed in your creative endeavours. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Keep creating, keep innovating and keep making your artistic dreams a reality.